LOCKS stands for Lots of Copies Keep Stuff Safe and was established at Stanford University Libraries in 1998 as uh, a technology to collect, uh, pre preserve and provide access to ebook and e-journal content to which uh, an academic library has subscribed. The UK LOCKS Alliance is a cooperative of UK libraries um, that are deploying the LOCKS technology to identify and negotiate and build local archives of scholarly material that librarians and academics deem significant. LOCKS acts as the equivalent of a digital library shelf. So a library sets up uh, a LOCKS box within their institution. They um, install the software on a dedicated server. Um, and then a librarian configures uh, content for collection according to local collection priorities, so what that, um, what that institution's academics deem significant. The LOCK software then contains um, web crawling uh, capabilities, and that web crawler goes out and fetches the content, so it's an exact copy of that content which is preserved within the LOCKS box. For the library, stewardship is still an important concept and LOX helps libraries to um, take custody and control of the digital assets that are important to them. An extension of that uh, custody that LOX provides is that it allows them to provide access to content when they need it. So that can either be in the short term if there's a temporary problem with a publisher's website, or in the longer term if that publisher no longer provides access to the material uh, because they've discontinued it or it's transferred to another publisher, or simply because that institution has terminated their subscription with that, um, with, with that journal. So LOCKS allows the library to continue to provide access when needed. The distributed nature of LOCKS allows libraries to get involved in digital preservation without requiring significant overheads. So they can uh, invest um, small amounts in setting up uh, a locks box and dedicating staff resources to the activity, which allows the library to engage with digital preservation at a local institutional level. The distributed approach of locks avoids the reliance on a single institution or a single source of funding and allows the community as a whole to avoid those problems and so it allows libraries um, to participate, to take advantage of those local collections uh, while avoiding um, potential points of failure. ADENA provides a variety of support for the UK LOX Alliance members. Um, it provides first-line technical support so in the event that there's a problem with an individual LOX box um, we provide a help desk service for that. We are working to build and improve on uh, current levels of documentation. Um, we provide a monthly roundup trying to keep um, members abreast of developments in the field more generally. We also undertake software development, so at the moment we're looking to, um, to improve the user interface and usability of LOCKS as a whole, and we also undertake content development, that is negotiations with publishers or content testing to make available new content for preservation. As for our hopes for the future, we've uh, established a UK LOCKS Alliance steering committee and uh, that allows the community to take some ownership of um, the UK LOCKS Alliance and the direction in which it's heading. In terms of priorities for members, uh, improved access to content and an increased range of content um, are key.